Luke, you ass. No, no, all right. Hello, YouTubers. <laughs> all of those who happen to watch. Another delicious, glorious package. Ugh. So let's rip this bad boy open. My steroid infused arms. Ugh. Nah, alright. So, let's see what we got in this package. So, alright. This person put these in some. What kind of. I wonder what, what these could be. Hmm. Let's open them one at a time. These are in somewhat good condition. Somewhat good. Need a little bit of cleaning. Okay. First one is another copy of Insector X. This came in a lot, obviously, as you can tell. Insector X. Good shooter game. Involves insects. I didn't say incest. Sean. Alright. Okay, next game here is uh, Cruc Light Crusader. It's kind of like a Diablo clone. Controls, sorry, controls a little bit stingy, but the gameplay and all the contents of this game is pretty in depth. You know, it has a lot of stuff in there. I want to open this up, and see how much, how big the uh, ROM board is. Probably huge. I think it's a Macedon, probably, because all the content they put in that. Alright, this last one, a lot of people are going to be either kind of jealous. Heh. <laughs> they kind of sealed this up individually, because I guess that's how awesome it is. Kind of excited. They, we used to have this as a copy, but I don't know what the hell happened to it. Either it got sold off or it got lost in the sands of time or something. I don't know. But. Alright. Either way, it was one of my favorites back in the day. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Hmm. What is this one? What is this one? Oh. Ooh. 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 Ooh, Sonobi 3, The Return of the Ninja Master. I know probably going to get a lot of requests for me to play this, so... I haven't played this in ages, you know. I haven't, ever since I uh, lost contact with the other copy I had, I didn't really dive into the, um, the game on emulation or anything like that. Because it just didn't feel the same, you know. Feel, playing with an actual controller is what it, where it's at. You know, these games right here, these this lot I got, which was for ten bucks. You know, most of these, you know, some of these go for like um five bucks here and there. Most of these anyway, because you know, light Chris lag again, beautiful lag, 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 gotta love many cam quick cam capture sucks, cause it's lags like crazy. Okie dokie. After I've done doing my little contaro. Or the hell it was called. So I took a Nash here for a minute. But these three games here, except into one. These two games, rather, then. Right here are very underlooked and underappreciated. That's uh, what brought up the value of me purchase, eh, purchasing them. At first, when I was younger, I did not like Light like Crusader. You know, because the controls are crap. Even when I was a kid, I even could, I quite tested on how crap the controls were for it. I mean, the controls are not perfect, but everything else in it is just good. You know, it's just straight up good. 
you know. Everyone obviously already seen Sector X in gameplay. If they have it, I could do gameplay of all three of these after. You know. Tonight I am doing the live on Blog TV for a little while. It's gonna probably be like thirty minutes. Just to show off these games. That's it. That's all I'm gonna be doing. Just showing these off and calling it quits. So I can go to bed. The funny thing about this is though about Sector X is Taito made it. I pronounced that correctly. I can never get the Japanese names usually down correctly ever. But you guys, not a lot of people to notice that who was in court, even though they're the ones that probably just published it. But that's the thing about this game. No one really knows at the top left corner. You know, you know. Obviously, the the cover isn't truly amazing. The guy looks like on that looks like a fairy. And that's just this gigantic robotic bee, but you know, at least it was better than what Mega Man One's cut box was. And can you believe that Mega Man One goes for twenty bucks? Mega Man One, the first freaking Mega Man goes for twenty bucks. Twenty bucks, thirty bucks, most likely twenty bucks. You go on Amazon, it's twenty bucks. You go on eBay, it's twenty bucks. It's like the game is not that amazing. It's good, but not that amazing. The other the sequels are a heck of a lot better. Hell, I can go on go on a vine and say that six is better. But ah, twenty bucks? God, I have to save two rounds of twenties and buy a Chrono Trigger or something. But yeah, um, that's about it, guys. Just wanted to show you those, those games. Um, if you got any questions about these, I'll do a video and explain it as I'm playing it. Um, also, I got I'm gonna be definitely gonna be playing some Shinobi, so. Um, it all depends on what people request first and how many people request it. I know a lot of people are going to be like, Snowby 3! Snowby 3! You know, it's going to go crazy. Because that's like in the little little circle of people we have here. Snowby's like everyone's like top pick. They're just, I know it's going to happen. <laughs> I just see it. <laughs> it's it's going to be a landslide victory. <laughs> though, though, might be some hope and maybe some light for like Crusader and in Sector X, who knows, but um, if you guys want to see either three of these, uh, let me know. I'll put some footage up for you.